Hello and welcome. In my last video, I talked about our involuntary nervous system, which is also known as autonomic nervous system. Now you have to know about the voluntary nervous system. Okay, this voluntary nervous system is also known as somatic nervous system. Somatic means our body muscles, mainly the skeletal muscles. So this somatic nervous system or voluntary nervous system comes under motor division of peripheral nervous system the entire classification i talked about in my last video anyway this entire nervous system is made up by our sensory and motor nerve fibers sensory nerve fibers are actually afferent and motor nerve fibers are actually efferent okay basically these neurons arises from the brain i mean in the brain there is a one specific area is known as premotor area or precentral gyrus I have talked about already gyrus sulcus of the brain in my very 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 earlier videos you can check those now this motor neurons is divided into two part one is upper motor neuron lower motor neuron what are these things this upper motor neuron is originates from the precentral gyrus both side okay both side of the cerebrum and their axon or the tail tail forms the corticospinal tract i mean corticospinal means from the cortex to the spinal cord so these tracts or the axon of these uh, motor neurons i mean upper motor neuron go to the spinal cord now in the spinal cord specifically in the anterior part of the spinal cord i mean the ventral part of the spinal cord there are so many tracks comes under upper motor neuron these are anterior lateral corticospinal tracts lateral medial reticulospinal tract rubrospinal tract tectospinal tract vestibulospinal tract okay so these are basically uh, comes under upper motor neuron lower motor neurons these lower motor neurons arises from the directly spinal cord these lower motor neurons are divided into three categories okay these are somatic motor neurons special visceral motor neurons and general visceral motor neurons okay now one by one first of all somatic motor neurons these neurons only supplies the every skeletal muscles of our entire body these somatic efferent neurons or somatic uh, motor neurons are divided into three part okay these are alpha motor neuron beta motor neuron and gamma motor neuron first of all alpha motor neuron it is very very important alpha motor neuron is a very vast amount of numbers in our body it directly goes to the effector organ i mean other neurons has ganglion as i told in my earlier videos that other neurons goes in uh, particular ganglion acts as a relay station and from the ganglion another neuron goes but this alpha motor neurons doesn't go to any relay station i mean it doesn't go under any kind of ganglion now a single alpha motor neuron synapse or it uh, connects with the 150 muscle fibers on an average now these alpha motor neurons are also divided into three part one is slow fatigue fast fatigue and fast fatigue resistant well these things i will talk about in details in physiology chapter not here now the beta motor neurons these neurons directly supplies the intramuscle fibers of muscle spindle what is muscle spindle i already talked about these things in my earlier skeletal muscle videos you can check those and this beta motor neuron is divided into two part one is slow contractile and there is fast contractile and now the gamma motor neuron this gamma motor neuron directly supplies the muscle spindle entirely okay now this gamma motor neuron is divided into two part one is dynamic and another is static dynamic consists of bag one fiber and static consists of bag two fibers again at these things i will talk about details in physical chapter not here and now coming back to the second component which was special visceral motor neurons these neurons are actually involved in our facial expression phonation i mean uh, speaking ability of speaking and mastication and swallowing okay general visceral motor neuron which is also known as general visceral efferent neuron gbe actually these neurons are supplies mainly our cardiac muscle and smooth muscle of arteries and now the sensory neurons the sensory neurons is also known as afferent neurons these neurons arises from the peripheral part of the body and the fibers is coming towards the spinal cord okay and the nucleus also presents inside of the spinal cord now there are so many types of sensory neurons depending on their specific receptors now what are receptors we'll talk about later so see you soon till then bye